Hi everyone and welcome to my place. If you're looking for a beautiful recipe that's got some milk powder, some rose petals, essential oils of rose, and some Epsom salts, which is magnesium sulfate, which is a really, really good for getting rid of all those little aches and pains that the body might have, this is fabulous. I don't know whether Cleopatra would have bathed in this, but you know, it doesn't matter, because we we've got the technology and we can get into it. So anyway, into here I've got a cup and a half and I've got the recipe here. There's a cup and a half of milk powder and then a half a cup of Epsom salts, which is magnesium sulfate. That goes into there. It's the cramps after ballet that I don't like. Give that a little stir up like so. And then into that, I'm going to put a quarter of a cup or you could put half a cup of rose petals. Now don't be panicking, panicking and thinking, oh my goodness, I don't want those in my bath. Well, I've got you covered because I'm going to put them into little bags. Give that a lovely stir. Now, if you wanted to add a bit of color to that, what you could add into that is a little bit of mica powder. Just add a little bit of this goes a long way. So just be very careful when you're using that and just stir that. I actually just prefer it as it is, but as you mix and blend it, you will get that lovely pink color. So it's the amount that you put into that which is going to determine just what the color looks like. Normally I would do this in the blender to get all those little bits of rose petal all blended down, but for today's purposes, that'll be fine. And then into that, I'm, I only put six drops of rose oil into this, but you could put as much as you wanted to, or if there was another fragrance like frankincense that you wanted to put into that, then you could do that. Then with that, once you've got that all blended, just so that you don't get those little wee pesky little things, those rose petals in the bath, because there's nothing worse, what I like to do is to just get these little bags and put it into the bag like so. And I put this into a big jar because you will find that little bits will, see how it's all sort of like started, there's little dusty bits coming out. I feel, have these in my bathroom and I put this into a nice jar and I've got one here, so I'll just do that for you now. Put that into there. And it's a couple of tablespoons is all you need into each bag and just put the top onto that, that's all ready to go. And there you have your little bag and then you just put that over the tap and when the tap's running, that'll all dissipate into the bath and then you can just dunk this into the bath as if you, like a tea bag and just lift the whole thing out, tip away the waste, put that down the toilet or into the disposal, some disposal unit, and then you have really lovely gifts and put little labels on them and they're just really, really lovely to just relax and enjoy. So I hope you've enjoyed that. Thanks for watching and I'll see you another day. Mm -hmm.